Oh yeah. Oh. This isn't gonna end good. <laughs> Sam is huge. <laughs> Good boy, look at you go! Hey, what's up YouTube? Will here, and today we're going into a random beautiful forest that I've been wanting to explore. It's Saturday right now, and I'm on a water fast, so I'm just real chill today, and I just wanna go out in the forest and just kinda of take off my shoes and walk around and find some mushrooms and pull some stones from the earth. Who knows? Sounds really hippie, really fluffy. I dig it, I love it. So uh, it's just a healing time, just detoxing, fasting. Gonna pick up my buddy in a second. We're just gonna go out there and just kind of chill and see what we can find. It's a beautiful forest that has a lot of potential for finding some amazing mushrooms and some amazing stones. So thanks so much for joining. You guys rock and let's get on this adventure. Bye. Guys, we are in the forest and it is beautiful, dense, wet, amazing out here. Tons of mushrooms all over the place, multiple different species. We got coral mushrooms growing all over the place. A whole bunch of mushrooms, I don't even know what they are. I would love to identify them. Coming on over here, there's this patch of mushrooms growing and it just, I don't know, they just look so cool to me. So I have my work cut out for me as far as identifying all these mushrooms in the future. But for now, I'm just gonna keep going through here and seeing what we can find that is edible, that I know for sure and medicinal and enjoying the forest. So let's continue on the journey of exploring this beautiful forest. rocks too if you look at this there's a ton of quartz running all through here in this forest you can see right there as well right here we got yeah man just a lot of good rocks and minerals out here so i think we're gonna go down here and up over onto this ridge a little bit hopefully find some chanterelles soon what do i see at the base of this tree my friends That looks like a chanterelle to me. Yeah, I'll break it open and verify for sure, but I think that's our first chanterelle. It looks fairly young, so this patch might not be fully up, but it does mean that in this general area, there's probably more. Let's keep looking around, guys. This one, a little bit of slug, or something ate the top, but that will be good. Too far gone, too far gone, too far gone. Damn shame. Yep. <laughs> you wild beast, you're right there? You rolling into something or something sting you? You okay? Get it. Uh oh. All right, you guys, poor little otter here just came running back. He was only like uh, 15 feet away from me, and I was cutting a mushroom, and he came running back, and he was jumping on the ground, rolling around, and 
scratching at his face and it looks like he got stung by a bee so I walked over here Definitely got a bee's nest. It looks like the bees are starting to recognize me. It's hopefully not a threat. Let's see if I can get you a good shot though. Came from my hand. He's a ferocious beast. He's trying to land on me. Sting my dog. Sting me. No good. Let's do the little bee dance for a second. Make sure he can't sting me. All right, guys, let's move on. I don't know what that was, though. It looks like it was a nest that was dug up. Um, but it looks really unique to me. So, cool. Let's, uh, let's move on. Otter's going to be okay. You okay, bud? Good boy. Come on, you wanna go this way? Let's go. You, you guys, look at this. Oh. She's beautiful. She's got a slug on her too. Come to me. Let me show you how it's done. The bees were guarding it for me. Let's go all the way down to the base here. Oh yeah. Look at that, huh? Nice white flesh. Solid. It's not hollow. Look at that. The gills whine out. Beautiful mushroom. Really nice. Good size to it. Hell yeah, you guys. I'm stoked about this. This is good. If we can find uh, 40 more of these, I'll be super pumped. That was awesome. All right, let's keep going. Look at this, you guys. Big old beast. Huh, interesting. After venturing deep into the forest, we made our way down towards a lake slash pond slash lake slash swamp slash stream slash water slash H2O. This is the footage of what we found. As we uh, pushed down this crazy hill and uh, found ourselves at a crazy swampy lake. And there's a beaver right there. Oh, there's a beaver right there. I gotta figure out a way to get to him. Whoa. Oh, this isn't gonna end good. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is all bad guys. This moss is so wet. And this is so slippery, holy crap, that's like ice. Um, how am I gonna do this? Step here, here, here. Oh my gosh, please don't fall, please don't fall. He's not coming up. 
He's a beaver. I think they can stay underneath there for hella long. All right, guys, I'm going to find a chill place just to sit around here. Oh, look at Otter, so majestic. Good boy, look at you. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this adventure. Um, it was really fun, a lot of good stuff. We got a whole thing of mushrooms, so please comment, like, share, and subscribe. Also, um, I would like to give a huge thanks to Crystal Spirit in Tacoma, Washington. If you're into rocks, minerals, and crystals, you'll love checking out their website. They're helping sponsor my channel, so thanks so much, Crystal Spirit. I got a link to their website in the description below, and I got some of my art displayed at their shop in Tacoma, and if you tell them that Will Brown sent you, you get 10% off discount. So thanks so much, Crystal Spirit. Huge thanks goes out to my Patreons. Thank you guys so much for your love and your faithful support. And I want to invite you guys all to check out my children's books. I got links to my Patreon and my children's books in the description below. You're more than welcome to check those out. A lot of really fun stuff coming out um, with my children's books. And I look forward to sharing it with you guys. Thanks so much for joining me on Will Brown Out. <laughs> thanks so much for joining me on Will Brown Art. Thanks so much for joining me on Will Brown Art. Please comment, like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.